This is an example of solving linear equations with fractional coefficients. Since multiplying both sides of the equation by a same non-zero value, we produce an equivalent equation. If we choose the least common multiple of all of our denominators and use that as the value we multiply both sides of the equation by, we will end up with an equation without fractional coefficients. Given the following equation, negative one-half x plus one-third equals one-fifth x minus one-sixth, we have the fractional coefficient of negative one-half, we have a one-third, a one-fifth, and negative one-sixth. So we want to find the least common multiple of the six, the five, the three, and the two. This would be 30. So since the least common multiple of all of these denominators is 30, if I multiply both sides of the equation by 30, I'll end up with 30 times negative one-half x, 30 times one-third, 30 times one-fifth x, and 30 times one-sixth. Well, when you multiply 30 times negative one-half x, you're going to end up with negative 15x. And then I end up with 30 times one-third, which is 10, 30 times one-fifth x, which would be 6x, and 30 times negative one-sixth, which would end up to be negative 5. Now I want to solve this equation. So to do this, I'm going to subtract 6x from both sides of the equation. This will result in negative 21x plus 10 equal to negative 5. Then I would subtract 10 from both sides of the equation. Now I'd have negative 21x is equal to negative 15. Now to solve this, I want to divide both sides by negative 21. This will give me negative 15 over negative 21, and negative 15 over negative 21 reduces to positive 5 sevenths. So x is equal to 5 sevenths. To check this, you can substitute this value back into our original equation, and you will notice that we end up with a true statement.